I started drawing when I was probably two or three years old and got my hands on some crayons and just kind of went at any piece of paper I could find. Since I was young, I was doing big drawings and um, I'm not a fussy person that likes little tiny things. I like really big things because I'm a very active person, so very physical. Uh, anyway, so knowing all of that, I went to the Santa Barbara Street Painting Festival one year. I saw all these people over there and I was like, what's going on? And he said, oh, that's a street painting festival. And I said, what's a street painting festival? Um, the weird thing is I had actually studied in Italy and there are street artists over there, but I never, I mean, I saw guys doing small things on the street, but I didn't see this kind of artwork that I was gonna see at the mission. So I walk over there and I see these amazing, huge portraits and landscapes and Renaissance masterpieces being made, made by all these artists that were drawing with pastels on the street. I had never come across anything like that. So I freaked out and said, I have to do that. That is the coolest thing I've ever seen in my life. So. The next year I got into it and didn't know anything about how to do it, just kind of showed up with my chalk. I had a plan, I was going to do this drawing that I designed and um, just started working and kind of figured it out as I went. There are a lot of things that you learn when you start drawing on ch uh, with chalk on the pavement that are not things that you have to deal with when you're working in a studio. So, you know, the environment, the surface, the heat. The crowds, everything was new to me, but um, I had some really cool artists around me that were um, you know, very supportive and helpful, so that was really good. But I immediately knew after that first drawing that I just thought this was amazing and super cool and I wanted to keep doing it. So it started out as a curiosity and then it immediately just blossomed into this intense desire to keep practicing this way. It's, I know it sounds really crazy, I'm drawing on the street, but um, you get addicted to it. People do get addicted to it, so I did. And I kind of just kept going. 